Small food producers often face challenges selling overseas. Finding the right distributors or retailers, figuring out how products like theirs are sold in other countries, and communicating effectively in another language are just a few examples. The Atlantic Food Export Project is a cooperation project funded under the Atlantic Area Interreg Programme, involving partners from seven Atlantic European regions. Our aim is to help small food producers in these regions to develop export sales. It's helped us build relationships with uh, European partners. It's helped us gain market insight into uh, where people shop, what sort of food they like to eat. So different cultural aspects as well and they can actually sign posters into various places um, where they feel that our products will sell. The Atlantic Food Export Project supports food producers in two ways. First, we offer one-to-one -one support that can save time and avoid costly mistakes. We help producers to focus only on suitable regional markets and distributors within those markets that are looking for quality foods with a story. The Atlantic Food Project has uh, brought us the ability to know several markets. Uh, we were able to uh, better understand those markets and their cultural habits because what works in one market may eventually not work the same way in the different markets. We help companies present sales information in the format buyers want, explaining unique selling points, how the product is packaged, shipped, handled and so on. We also assist with the language barrier. Second, we harness the power of working together through hosted cooperation meetings. Producers get to meet and explore opportunities for collaboration. The great um, triumph for us really is partnering with a French caviar company from the Dordogne called Novik and they are, um, they have now produced a, a caviar which is um, seasoned with Hal and Mon, um, and it's now on the British market, so we're very excited about that. There are four cluster groups, the drinks group, the bakery group, the health and organic group, and the specialty artisans. Each cluster group takes specific actions to build sales in selected markets. This could include exhibiting at a trade fair or organizing a trade mission to visit buyers. Alors, qu'est-ce que le projet Atlantic Food Export nous a euh, apporté euh, Plusieurs choses. Euh, D'abord, une méthodologie dans le choix des pays, parce qu'exporter, c'est bien, mais où et comment Donc aussi dans la méthodologie pour euh, essayer d'aborder un pays et dans la méthode de, de, de prospection. Et ça, c'est déjà deux éléments essentiels euh, qui, que nous ont montré l'étude préalable pour euh, voir les, les possibilités de notre entreprise. Smaller scale producers specialize in producing high quality products, often drawing on an artisan tradition or using the best local ingredients. With smaller pools of local customers, exports are key to growth. The Atlantic area is seen as an ideal first step for such companies to explore new markets, benefit from training and test their offer. The European Union supports initiatives like the Atlantic Food Export Project to help organizations in neighboring regions cooperate in tackling common challenges and working together for a more innovative, inclusive and sustainable Europe.